Hey, what is going on guys? JP Game here, and welcome back to Silent Hunter 5 with the Wolves of Steel Mega Mod Pack. Uh, now there's nothing happening right now, I just decided to record an intro while I had the chance. So, we are still in the English Channel. Uh, we just raided the harbor in the last episode, which was here in Plymouth. I went down here, I kind of scanned the area, I didn't find anything, so I'm going to go ahead and head back up to this port, um, <clears throat> and maybe catch some merchant ships coming in and out. Um, uh, I'm not sure if I will actually raid this port or not, depending on how defended it is, but I might go up here and possibly get some merchant shipping coming in and out of the English Channel. Uh, that's the big plan for now. So I'll leave it here until we uh, spot anything, or if anything else interesting happens. So yeah, see you later. Uh, hello everybody, uh, we're just diving in periscope depth right now. Uh, we do have a few merchants here, but unfortunately they're just little fishing boats. So, you know, nothing that interesting. I was hoping it was going to be, you know, like a full-on convoy, but that's not the case. Um, yeah, that's very unfortunate. But I decided to dive anyway just to make sure that they don't see me and possibly report me to, you know, nearby destroyers. So that's the plan. I'm just going to stay under, but it might be a good idea since uh, now we can check the hydrophone and possibly hear even more merchant ships moving along. Uh, I did get a contact report of a possible convoy that is coming out of here, which is pretty neat. Hopefully it's not escorted, it might be. Uh, but yeah, I, scra I abandoned the plan to evade this harbor because it was, uh, there were like a few destroyers patrolling uh, the entrance to it and I didn't want to deal with those. so. We're gonna try and pick off some merchants, lone, unescorted merchants, in this little area right here, and I'll check back once we finally see some good, large merchants. Hey, what is going on, guys? Uh, welcome back. Now, <clears throat> uh, we have spotted a merchant, and it's something other than a fishing boat. Uh, it's heading up this way. Um, uh, we're not that far away. I'm going to try and catch up with it and get a solution lined up. So that's the plan for now. Uh, I'm very excited because we finally, you know, found something. Hold on, let me unpause. Uh, we finally found something. You know, I was, I was like all in here. There are warships everywhere. It looks like we finally found... Uh, a decent mer merchant. So, I'm not sure whether or not I want to dive yet. Let me see if I can lock onto this. Um, Alright, I can, but it's very hard with the, what do you call it, the use, the uso or whatever. Uh, let me just get a rough estimate. This isn't. This isn't gonna be precise. I'm just. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna dive. Um. Let me. Switch to standard, so then we can go as fast as possible. I just about to out. Uh, alright. <clears throat> I guess I can start getting its course plotted, so... Because I don't need to be locked onto it at the moment. Alright. So let's... So... Start... I'll do... I'll do two minutes. <laughs> since it's still kind of far off. Going 17 knots now. 
Alright, let's pause it. Uh, boom. Alright, so this is its general course. Alright, so now that we have its distance in the time, let's see. So in two minutes it went 350. about five or six knots let's go s let's say six okay so the angle on bow is gonna be I'm assuming 90 degrees yeah 90 degrees well, let me clean that up a little bit More or less 90 degrees. So, <clears throat> I'm not sure when to dive. Obviously, I'm gonna have to dive at some point. The only thing is, is that if I do mess up, then I'm not gonna be able to use the deck gun on it since it is wavy. So, you know, I can't get, I can't get this. I can't mess up on this. Okay, we probably want to be a little closer, like within, I'd say within 3,000 meters should be fine. <laughs> so yeah, we're speeding quickly through here. Uh, I'm gonna stay on the surface a little bit longer. You know, we're still out of their visual range, and it is night, so we're fine there. And, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll go ahead and get in here, you know, get our solution inputted and fire upon this vessel. So, I'll check back with you guys once we are a bit closer and once we are about to fire on this merchant. Okay, just a quick checkup. I know I said that I would record back once we were a bit uh, closer, but uh, I have identified it. It is a medium steam freighter. I found this medium merchant, or medium steam merchant. Uh, from what I can tell, it kind of looks similar, so that's what I'm gonna go with. It is 5,000 tons. Uh, also, we are getting, we definitely are getting closer into the, our range circle that I want to be in. So, I'm gonna dive soon, probably now in fact. Uh, yeah. Let me change this a bit. I want to be within 2,500 meters, so once we cross this line, I'll go ahead and dive. <laughs> I'm surprised our officer was able to identify this in this kind of weather. It looks like we, this is going to be good. You know, we're in range. It ha it's night, can't see us. The only bad thing is that it's wavy, but we shall be able to push through it anyway. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna dive now, periscope depth, and then we'll set up everything on the targeting computer. So our range is gonna be roughly... 2,000 meters, maybe? 
Oh, we're still drifting forward. <clears throat> Let's input the other things first. So, uh, angle on bow. We determined that would be about 90 degrees off their port side, so. Oops, 90 degrees. Oh, let me go to zero, so. Alright, 90 degrees to port. Alright, uh, speed is about five, six knots. Range. Are we still drifting forward a little bit? Hmm. Range is gonna be about. I'm gonna say 1500 meters. Just to be a bit safe. Okay. And put that in. Get our gyro angle. Here we go. Alright, so this is where we will fire. Let's go ahead and flood these tubes. Uh, set them fast. Alright. Here we go. Now I gotta wait. <laughs> uh. Oh, come on. It always saves at, like, right when I'm about to fire or something. Alright, here we go. It's made it impact time 1 minute and 12 seconds. Okay. Alright, tube 1, fire. Tube two fire. All right, let's slow it just a little bit. If it misses, I'm gonna be. Doesn't look like it will, but if it does, I'm gonna be so upset. <laughs> or if it's a dud. Yes! Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. It better sink. Oh, please sink. <laughs> of course it was a dud. have to shadow it and take it out with the deck gun. Neuer Kontakt, Kriegsschiff mit schneller Fahrt. Näher kommend. Alright. In großer Entfernung. Man, if that if that second torpedo hit, then it would have definitely sunk. Neues Ziel wird erfasst. Yep, still going. Darn. Alright. Oh, 
All right, let's start following it. Um, yeah, we're gonna shadow it and possibly see if it will sink or not. If it doesn't, then I might have to take it out with the dead gun eventually. Alright, that's what I'm gonna do. Um, I'll see you guys soon.